Another freshie, it hasn't even been set up yet. It's uh, currently 20 below in Minnesota right now, but for the rest of the world that's uh, never experienced that cold, I wouldn't recommend it. It's absolutely miserable actually. Losing a door. No. I just remembered this thing's still three wheel drive. Yeah. There ain't no way that looks. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Step on the brake. I'm on the brake. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh. <laughs> oh. We're doing good. You see, this thing is a utility vehicle. Yeah, that's why we bought it instead of a skid steer. Yeah. I think it's a snowmobile. It is a snowmobile. Dude, look at it. Nice and fresh. We don't even know what color it is yet. We should but we just don't remember. I see purple. Oh no, we're gonna have to get rid of those ASAP. Don't worry, I could probably uh, call my guys and get some more. Rip this thing off quick, come on. Hey, fun fact actually, hold up. Last year when we were ordering these snowmobiles, we posted a poll on Instagram and we said, which sled do you guys want us to do? And pretty much everyone chose like one of them and then we completely just disregarded it. <laughs> and we got the least voted color. <laughs> so without further ado, Hey! All right, well, we're gonna set this baby up and uh, I don't know what we're gonna do after that because it's negative 10 degrees out. So this slide's for the group. Like, it's all of ours. We're one sixth fifth grip. <laughs> we're one fifth owners. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, all right. TG Tell your friends that watch our videos to say hi. <laughs> Whenever we meet a sub, and then whenever Mike's saying goodbye to them, and he goes, yeah, tell your friends that watch we say hi, they always go, what? Okay. Dude, it's so you do painfully say that time, awkward. Mike. And I always ask Mike, why do you say that? No, I only say it to the younger kids that I know have friends in school that watch us, or at least I assume. Maybe I'm just a dick for assuming that they what have if, friends. What if they just go, Psh, my friends don't know who you are. <laughs> I mean, I'm That's gonna, always kind of yeah, what I expect them to say. <laughs> Check out the new shoes. So yeah, we pretty much have the widest skis we could possibly put on this. Obviously, if you can tell, they're timber sled skis. <laughs> it looks like a wide body kit. Dude, I don't, I mean, I don't think this has ever been done for good reason. For probably good reasons. For good reasons. Most reasons. But what are we gonna do with it? I don't know. Ah. Dude, you're funny, bro. Your whole setup. Still no ice on my wrist, but I came through swinging Mike Tice with the hits. I'm as nice as it gets. Give me a minute and I might hit a lick. Ain't nobody coming with the steez. Came in with the heat like the grease. I don't ever know what they believe. From the 7 1, I gotta leave. Hold up, hold up. These skis are great for jumping. Bro, it's like parachutes in the air. <laughs> All right, boys, so this Saturday, February 27th, we're having a snowmobile meetup slash ride out in our hometown of Cormorant, Minnesota, basing out of a restaurant called the Cormorant Inn. So if you guys wanna come, it starts at noon. We're planning on leaving the parking lot at right around one, and then we got like a 20 mile loop that will eventually bring us back to the Cormorant Inn where there's gonna be food. We got a bunch of stuff to give away, and uh, we'll just be hanging out with you guys. If you guys are interested in coming, we have more details on our website and on Instagram. We're hoping that it's gonna be a good turnout. It should be a good time. So we'll see you guys on Saturday. We made it to Houghton, Michigan. The most beautiful state in all of Michigan. Made it with the Great Lakes Nation boys. How many we got of you today? Uh, five. We got five, we got Evan, we got Cole. Evan, check this out, come here. We brought the Trizinger for you. <laughs> Just for me, the front fender looks like the teeth of somebody that would be riding this thing. Does it not? <laughs> Don't let your meatloaf. First, let's see, it runs great, dude. No, it does. I always cut it short.
Bro, you just slammed it to the moon. I can't believe, I think we just actually broke it. I mean, it still works. She's good. <laughs> it doesn't have a wheelie stop now. Holy crap. Dude. Welcome to Houghton, Michigan. I put oh, my yeah. chaos front end on the front of the switchback. So she's narrow and ready for side on. Oh, and I put CJ's it. can on it. He doesn't know, but I'd imagine he's not going to be doing much solo riding. I was thinking about taking Ken's, but I figured he would be doing some solo riding while we are gone. <laughs> no, you guys, Ken's, uh, Ken's not doing any snowmobiling this weekend because you guys blew us up on the merch shop, and he will be in that, in the merch bay for the rest of the weekend. <laughs> I think I may have stuck the day on lockdown with this one. <laughs> this is uh, this is riding Houghton in a nutshell. Yeah. For a snowmobile. It's crazy, dude. You gotta work to keep the skis down. pretty much totaled my sled, I think. Yeah, that's not supposed to be like that. Just between the two trees, uh, <laughs> and they're a little bit too big to cut down, I think. Ryan, I think that you should just floor it and then just take the rest of it off. Dude, this ski is literally jammed in there. Ready? Yeah. One, One two, two, three. Holy crap. Update, we got it out. Ryan was just overreacting, everything's fine. <laughs> Classic. <laughs>
Do a chain case. Really? I think it's toast. Seriously? Yeah. This is actually not when good. You, when you grab the secondary and you can turn it, and the chain case makes chain case noises, the incline of attack is tighten up the bolt and just make it really tight. Call it a day. It did not sound good. No, I heard you. I was right behind you. So the chain case hopefully was just loose, but either way, Dave's uh, A-arm finally completely broke in half. So we're going to make our way out of this ravine before, Man, we, before we have to make our way out of the ravine in the dark. Jeez. Okay, okay. Hey, if if you jump roof, up on the roof and then jump onto that. Yep. Send it. Three, two, one. <laughs> Wait, I'm breaking this shit, bro. It's not breaking. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> My dough is perfect. Yeah. Look at this.